Hi, good evening! Welcome back to my channel. So this is vlog number 13 and I'll be unboxing my Starbucks haul for the month of June. Yay! So, um, before we start, um, medyo overwhelmed ako sa mga nangyari sa akin for the past month nung June. Kasi nga, June is my birth month. So, uh, I celebrated my 31st birthday last June 20. So, during that time then, I was able to receive one of the best gifts ever. Um, I was uh, awarded the Outstanding City Employee of the Local Government of Manila on the day of my birthday. So, I have been chosen by the, by the panelists to be one of the 10 Outstanding City Employees. So, for the year 2019 from Santa Ana Hospital, please welcome Nurse 4, Jean Patrick Y. Tan. Once again, congratulations to the 10 Outstanding Employees Awardee. Uh, ito yung aking oh, naging award. And, and I share this to all of the people who believed in me and to my family, to my friends, to the, to the Santa Ana Hospital employees, patients and relatives that have catered from the past, and syempre mga mentors ko, Dr. Neri Siscon, Dr. Jojo Siscon, to the admin, Dr. Grace Padilla, Dr. Jesus C. Season Jr., our hospital director, uh, and Ma'am Tess Nivella, our OAC chief nurse. So, napakalaking honor and uh, responsibility to be awarded this kind of uh, recognition. So, thank you, thank you, thank you. Kaya, kailangan siya may place dito sa aking Starbucks room. So, and aside from that, nung nag-birthday din ako, nag-celebrate din ako ng birthday ko, it was a week-long celebration na ginawa sa akin ng mga kasamahan ko sa Santa Ana Hospital and I think my COC and ancillary staff for that. And syempre, my super friends, my green team family, and my other friends, college friends, high school friends, and syempre, my family na sobrang reason ko and my motivation to do well in my craft in the nursing profession and syempre my graduate school family din for accepting me and uh, mentoring me again to the UERM thank you so much for giving me the best education so um, ano ba ba mga nangyari sa akin ng June so nung June yun din we went to Aqua Planet and syempre, the team building na ginawa ng COC and Ancillary Family sa Tayabas, Quezon. And thank you, Sir Benji, for um, accommodating us dun sa lugar ninyo and for touring us around dun sa lugar ninyo. So, basically, yun lang. Nangyari. Yun ang mga nangyari sa akin noong June 2019. And it's an overwhelming feeling na parang it's a bigger responsibility ngayon na kailangan ako ang maging role model for the rest of the employees of Santa Ana Hospital to do, to be their, the best version of themselves to inspire them, to motivate them para soon they'll receive such recognition. So, without further ado, let's start my unboxing of my Starbucks haul for month of June 2019. First, let's start with this one. So, this is oh, the Trenta Cold Cup na Nautical. So, this was released third week of June. Uh, ah, second week of June. Tapos, um, I got this for 695 Together with this uh, tumbler, a uh, cold cup, nag-release din sila ng series of um, 
merchandise. Meron din silang steel wall tumbler, a water bottle na steel, and an acrylic na isa pang cold cup na mas maliit na version nito. And an acrylic tumbler. So, meron din silang tail card which I'll be showing you guys later na release din nila yon together with this merchandise. So, this is the Trenta Nautical Cold Cup. Next naman from this booth ay, syempre, yung continuation ng kanilang Zodiac series. So, this is the Starbucks card with card holder na Cancer. So, just in time for the start of the Zodiac Cancer. And, syempre, the double wall ceramic tumbler na Cancer. So, yung kanilang emblem ng Cancer na crab. And dyan, this is a double wall ceramic tumbler. And this is priced at 1,475. Pero, ito namang Cancer card. For an initial reload of 1,500, you can, you can get this card na pwede mong gamitin to purchase this double wall ceramic tumbler. So, for 1,500 pesos, you can get these two merchandise from Starbucks. So, next natin na Zodiac ang inihintay natin. I think that's Scorpio. I know, Aquarius or Virgo. Basta ganun. So, nilabas na nila. Just a recap. Siyempre, nag-start sila with Aries. Then, followed by Taurus. And then, may Zodiac, Gemini. And now, Cancer. Okay. Ano bang laman nito? So, wala na. Paper bag, paper bag. And, syempre, gift tags. Gift tags. Yep. From the first loop. Mm -hmm. Next, from this paper bag. So, ano to? Medyo uh, rumble na to na binili ko from online sellers, from the collectors groups na kasama ako sa mga kasama kong home collectors and syempre doon din sa Starbucks stores okay so let's start with this one open na oh this is a festival tumbler so kuno collect ako kasi din ngayon yung festival tumbler na ni-release no 2013 However, ngayon kasi sa Starbucks, hindi na siya nagre-release ng mga festival tumbler. So, nag-discontinue na ang pag-release nila ng festival tumbler noong 2014. And in 2015, nag-release lang sila ng isang festival tumbler na meron na ng lahat ng festivals na meron ang Pilipinas in one tumbler. So, hanapin ah, po ko nasa siya. Ayun. Wait. Nakita ko sa inyo. So, yeah. This is the festival tumbler na kaisa-isa na release no 2015. So, lahat na ng festivals in the Philippines nandiyan siya. Uh, from, the da from Davao, which is Kadayawan, from Boracay, Ati-Atihan, Naga, Peña Francia, Baguio, Panagdenga, Cagayan de Oro, Cagayan Festival, Iloilo, um, yung kanilang Dinagyang Festival, Jensen naman, The Tuna Festival, uh, ano ba ba? Bacolod, Mascara Festival, and syempre Cebu, which is Sinulo. So, ito yung 2015. Pero, during the year 2013-2014, naglabas sila ng different festival tumblers of the different festivals in the country. So, for example, uh, like this one that I purchased from Mom Vernaliza, who, who happens to be a collector in the Starbucks Collectors Group and Philippine Starbucks Circle Group or the P uh, Philstar and um, FSCG, Filipino Starbucks uh, Collectors Group. So, this is the Cagayan Festival of Cagayan de Oro, Philippines. So, this was released in 2013 at yung mga ganitong tumblers for you to purchase this one. Pupuntahan mo siya doon sa lugar kung saan sineselebrate ang festival na to. For the month long ng kanilang festive, ng kanilang festive uh, celebra celebration, doon lang siya mailalab, nilabas. So, after the celebration, discontinue na rin siya. So, very limited siya. So, this is the Cagayan. And, meron na ako ng ganito na 
Dinag Yang, I have Panagbeng, uh, I have Ati Ati. So, medyo pa madami, madami-dami pa akong kailangan i-collect na ganito. I still need the Senulo, I still need uh, mascara, the tuna, um, uh, ano ba ba? Uh, huh? Siguro yun pala, yun pa ang kailangan ko. And Peña Francia. Yun. So, this is the Cagayan Festival. And this is sold for around uh, parang 550 lang siya noon. And I got this for uh, 700 pesos, which is not bad for a collector item. Next naman, another festival, uh, Tumblr. So this was released in 2013. Yan, another one, Mascara Festival. So Mascara is being celebrated during uh, the month of October in Bacolod, Philippines. So last year, um, 2018, I was able to attend the Mascara Festival in Bacolod. Pero I was a little early dun sa kanilang main culminating activity. So I was a week earlier dun sa kanilang main program. Pero still, I was able to join the month-long celebration of Mascara Festival in Bacolod. So there you have it. Mascara Festival in Cagayan. Both uh, tumblers ay na-purchase ko kay Mang Bernaliza. Thank you, Mang Bernaliza. Next naman natin ay syempre, the double wall ceramic tumbler na collaboration with Starbucks and Paired. So, Paired is an, parang, I, I think it's an Australian brand na ang kanilang line ay sunglasses. So, nagkaroon sila ng collaboration and this was released June of 2019. Parang June 14 yata siya ni-release or June, second week of June. Yun. So, kasama pa nito, Paired na double wall ceramic tumbler ay, syempre, the Paired and Starbucks collaboration Cold Cup. So, this is sold at, ito ay, bin, na, na, sell nila for 495, I think. And this one is sold at 1,095 pesos. Ang nakakatuwa pa dito, kasi, ang Starbucks paired, uh, Starbucks and paired collaboration, ay release lang to 100 stores nationwide. And 4 to 5 pieces of each merchandise lang per store. So, nung nilabas ito, medyo kinakabahan na kasi baka hindi ako makakuha dahil nga medyo malalayo, medyo um, limited yung stores na nilabasan, na nilabasan sorry for the word, na nag-release nag ng Starbucks paired collection. So, nag-message ako sa mga kasam kasamahan ko sa collectors group kung saan yung list Kasi si Starbucks, hindi, hindi pa siya nag-release kung saan yung mga top 100 stores nila. Kung saan ilalabas si Starbucks and their collection. So, nag-message ako sa kanila. Nag-post ako on Facebook asking for help where to find this merchandise. Kasi nga, this, this is a limited edition and I'm collecting those uh, web collaboration. So, a girl responded. Ayaw niya nalang magpanim. Pero sabi niya na he will, uh, she will help me na makakuha ng ganito. So, sinabi ko kung anong mga stores ako malapit. And, apparently, nung tumawag siya sa Starbucks Meza, ang sabi doon, hindi pa daw sa kanila nag-release ng ganito at wala pa daw advice. Tapos, tumawag ulit siya uh, later, uh, later that evening na available na daw. So, she was able to reserve these pieces uh, for me. So, sinabi niya na kailangan niya makakuha ng ganito for a, a gift for a friend and binigyan niya yung name ko na ako nga yung magpipick up. But apparently, I'm on my way to that store kasi nananalig talaga ako na merong silang Starbucks paired because the store was listed sa Starbucks official list na mag-release ng paired. So, pumunta ako ng Starbucks Meza, try my luck na makakuha ng ganito. And I'm so lucky enough na pagdating ko doon, nilalabas pa lang nila ito doon sa kanilang shelf so ibig sabihin by 6pm hindi pa nababawasan yung ganito nila kasi 
parang nakalimutan nila na that day pala dapat siya i-release. So, nung pagpunta ko doon, sabi ko doon sa uh, sa store, uh, parang manager nila, si Denise, uh, nakuha ako ng ganito. And, yung tumulong sa akin na tumawag ay on the line. So, parang coincidence lang din na ando doon na ako, tinatawag niya para mag-reserve, para makakuha ako ng ganito. So, ayun, to cut the story short, nakakuha ako ng pair collection. So, in uh, this collection, simultaneous ulit ang kanilang paglala paglalabas, pag-release in the Southeast Asian nations. So, during that day, same day din ng release ng Starbucks pair in Singapore, in Malaysia, and I think in Thailand. So, sa Philippines, naglabas lang sila ng tatlong line of merchandise. One double wall ceramic tumbler, one cold cup, and the other one is the steel uh, tumbler na hindi ko nang masyadong kinokollect. So, I'm happy with this uh, merchandise. And sa Singapore, naglabas din sila ng different pa na mga paired collections. So, sa, sa Singapore, meron sila ng water bottle na paired collection. They have this uh, pouch and I think they have this tote bag. So, pero okay na ako to have my double wall and my cold cup. Thank you, Starbucks Neza. Next, from this bag, syempre, ah, another cancer na Starbucks card na I used to purchase these tumblers. Next naman natin is yung sinasabi ko sa inyo kanina na tail card na nautical collection na kasamang nilabas ng ating Trenta Cup kanina. So, this tail card, I, you can get this tail card for an initial reload of 1,000 pesos na pwede mo rin ipang-purchase ng food and beverage and merchandise. So, yan. My first tail card collection. Pero pa ba dito? Wala na. Next naman natin ay from this loot. So, halo-halo na siya ulit. Ah, okay. This is the Grand Day Cold Cup. Also from the Nautical Collection ni Starbucks. So, this is being sold for 495 and this is the Trenta Cup for 695 So, yan yung difference nila. Okay. Next naman natin ay another rent account. So, yun din, kaparehas lang nito. Madoble yung bili ko. Pero, ito pala ay uh, para hindi naman sayang at hindi naman uh, sayang din ng space dito kung hindi display ko. Ito ay uh, tawag nito, uh, ito trade ko to a collector din in Mexico. So, ipapadala ko pa siya papunta ng Mexico para sa aming trade. Game. Next naman natin, mamaya na itong mga cards. Ang dami kong cards. Yay! Next naman ay also from the nautical collection ng Starbucks. So, this is the Sailor Barista Keychain and another Sailor Barista Keychain. Ito ang boy, ito ang girl. So, kung makikita ninyo ang kanilang difference. Dun sa damit and dun sa holder. So, ito uh, meron siya nung parang uh, salbabila, ito naman yung anchor. So, this is sold for 225 pesos each. Yan. For their nautical collection. Next naman ay this one. Siyempre, yung Rainbow Bright na Rainbow Bright Slug na collection nila na nirelease noong February 14. Meron na ako actually nitong complete collection nila pero bumili ulit ako ng isa pang violet for my mom. Kasi gusto niya, favorite niya ang color ng violet. So, there you have it. Nakakuha na ako ng, ng violet na steel tumbler. So, this is sold at 1,425. Next, from this bag, this parcel came from Doc Rian Andrada, one of the admins of Starbucks Collectors Philippines. So, let's go paint kung anong laman. Oh, oh, this is our Starbucks Collectors Group 
na personalized t-shirt. So, meron yung kanilang, ito yung kanilang uh, amin, amin palang uh, pride merchandise from the Starbucks Collectors Philippines. So, meron yung rainbow color na parang heart. Naka-heart siya. Pero, actually, smoke siya. Usok. Tapos, SCP Starbucks Collectors Philippines na nakahugis siyang mug kung mapapansin niyo plus yung heart shape na smoke effect with the hashtag extra shot of pride yeah so this another good uh, merchandise from our group pero meron pa siyang kasama lanyard so open natin yung check na so so, this is our official lanyard, Starbucks Collectors Philippines, with the rainbow color. So, in support with the LGBTQIA plus community, and in celebration of the Pride 2019, which I have attended last June 29, sa Marikina Sports Complex. Ang Marikina Sports Complex ay ang official, um, events place or complex place for the uh, Metro Manila Pride. So, every year sinasagawa during the month of June ang uh, Metro Manila Pride uh, tapos we have, uh, which is celebrating the hashtag Resist Together. Last, this is my first time na naka-attend ng kanilang Pride and sobrang daming tao. Like, 52,000 to 70,000 people attended the, the Metro Manila Pride. Rain or shine, tao lang, tao lang kami. Tao kami, ulan lang sila. So, rain or shine, nandudoon lahat ng LGBTQIA+. At hindi lang siya exclusive for the LGBTQIA+. Community, it is open to all people. Whether straight, bisexual, ka, straight guy, straight female, or kung ano man ang inyong gender preference, ang inyong sexual orientation, or your sexual or uh, expression, or your sexual characteristics, you are open to attend the Pride March. So sa Pride March, tina tinatakel doon, uh, it is a celebration of the LGBTQIA+, encouraging acceptance. And syempre, ang sinusulong po ng LGBTQIA+, is the SOGI Bill. So, doon, uh, tarang pinapakita din ng mga LG, ng LGBTQIA+, na unity, the togetherness of the community can resist all problems and all challenges. So, it's a celebration of our expression, of our preferences, of our identity, of who we are. So, uh, we are not expecting for all the people to accept uh, to accept us but we are expecting for your respect for our choices for our preferences because we are we are all humans we are also humans too so we deserve to be respected we deserve to have an equal treatment and we deserve to be treated as humans with emotions with feelings and syempre we have a heart to love to support to share to motivate and to inspire people it is our celebration it is our way of communicating to you to all the people that we deserve to be respected we deserve to be accepted and we, res we deserve to be treated the same as you treat your family as you treat your friends you treat your straight male and straight female loved ones we are also human we have feelings we have emotions nasasaktan din kami nagmamahal din kami at ginagawa namin ang lahat ng aming makakaya to be accepted in this society not to be discriminated but to excel in our craft so that's the meaning of Metro Manila Pride. Kung for everyone, for other people, 
na sinasabi nila, ah, nagkakos lang ng traffic yan, nagkakos lang ng ganito, ng ganyan, nakakahiya, nakakadiri, mga bayo at mga salot. No! We have a responsibility for ourselves. And we have a responsibility for our community. Same thing as you, straight people, na nagsiselebrate din of your preference without any exemption, without limitations. We deserve our freedom. We deserve to be respected. And sa amin na nagsasama-sama kami in one gathering, it's just a day. Give it to us. And um, naging masaya naman ang Pride March. Wala naman mga nasaktan, wala naman masyadong na nasugatan or nahirapang huminga because of the huge number of population attended the Pride March. And I'm happy to uh, say na it's a success, it's, it is a successful event. And I congratulate the Metro Manila Pride Organization, Love Yourself, and the other organization na nagtulong-tulong to put up this Metro Manila Pride. And to the city of uh, Marikina, thank you for uh, giving us the opportunity to express ourselves. And thank you for letting us use the Marikina Sports Complex to be part of this momentous event for our lives as LGBT community member. And I'm inviting you, syempre, in-announce ko na, na the city of Manila will be having the Pride March. So, nung nandoon kami sa Pride March, ay may mga nakausap ako, representatives from the city of Manila. Syempre, I'm from the city of Manila. I work for the city of Manila. I, talk, I have talked to them and they told me na on March 2020, they'll be conducting a Pride March in Manila. Dati naman kasi ginagawa ang Pride March in Malate. So ngayon, gagawin na daw nila ulit sa Manila. Through the efforts and leadership of our new mayor, Mayor Isko Moreno. So thank you, Mayor, for um, your acceptance, for your love, and for your um, kind words towards the LGBT community. Thank you so much, Mayor. So let's proceed. Medyo naging emotional ako dun. <laughs> Next natin, from this new, ang ganda lang transition. Anyway, next from this new, this is from Sir Manny Mercado, a co-collector din. So, eto naman ay um, in order ko online. Tapos, pinadala niya kay Sir Alex Mercado na sobrang supportive din sa aking mga uh, lupo. So, Alcer Alex handed this to me through local courier Graham. So, this is the reusable cup collection, the Easter set. So, this was released um, last April in the US. So, this is the Canadian version of ah, the US version of the reusable cups Easter collection series. So, ito ay 6 different uh, reusable cups, tall size, of 6 different designs. So, uh, hindi ko lang siya tinatanggal sa ganito. Nimis ako na siya katulad ng iba pang mga reusable cups na nandun doon na comes in set. Thank you, Sir Manny, and thank you, Sir Alex. So, wala na ito. Next naman natin ay this lovely berries these lovely berries um, actually nilagay ko na lang siya sa canister ng uh, last acetate canisters pero this is the berista koala bear this is released in Australia and this is the Starbucks berista kangaroo also released in Australia so eto naman ay nakuha ko siya through the help of my super friend from his recent uh, tour or travel to Australia. Joker, thank you for supporting my uh, collection. So, siya ang tumulong para makakuha ako ng uh, koala and kangaroo na baby. 
canister. So this canister came so uh, came separately. So this is a custom made canister na pinagawa ko sa Divisoria para uh, ma-protectionan from dust yung aking mga bayonistas. Para medyo malesen din ako ng time sa paglilinis sa kanila. So, ay, a tip for all the collectors. Kung gusto ninyong maging neat at kapag uh, ma-stack sila properly, kung pwede mo siyang stack ng mga ganyan, ganyan uh, magandang ilagay sila sa mga canisters. So, Ngayon, nagtata-customize ako ng mga canisters for my tumblers, for my mugs, demitas, ornaments, and other merchandise like this Daylista. So, uh, and another tip, if you're placing your Daylista sa ganitong canister, never forget to put anti-molds or the silica gel or the desiccants or um, anti-moisture para hindi siya mag-discolor at para hindi magkaroon ng molds sa loob ng canister. So, yeah. May kangaroo, may kangaroo and may koala berista from Australia through the help of a friend, Joker. Next natin, from this paper bag. Medyo madami. Let's start with this cards. So, these are the Starbucks-inspired cards na BIP. So, pwede siyang magamit through the BIP system sa MRT, sa LRT. So, this is a personalized card na meron akong name nitong uh, Pilipinas in Alibata and another card na patayo naman ang kanyang print na Alibata then with with my name on it. So, pwede siyang magamit through the BIP system or the BIP machine or the BIP tap, uh, tap machine sa mga LRTs, MRTs and other um, uh, establishments na nag accept ng deep payment. So, ito ay nilabas ng Starbucks Card Philippines with the help of um, Doc Rian Andrada. Yan, yung two designs. And, syempre, another tail card. Next naman natin ay from this bag. Ito ay ang kukumpleto sa aking Philippine Icon Mugs Manila version 1 So, ito, medyo mahirap na siyang hanapin This was released in 2013 So, this is the version 1 of Manila Mug uh, na ang print niya ay ang GP Meron din pang isang Manila Mug na ganito na version 2 in red also na meron naman ng kalesa pero ito yung medyo mahirap na hanapin so it has the SKU na na medyo importante yan sa amin bilang collector and I got this for a low price of 800 pesos through the help of Sir Ramon King from Pasig who is a collector din nakasamahan ko sa isang collector group na binenta niya siya ng murang mura 800 pesos pero uh, kung isa-sell siya sa iba pang mga platforms nasa 2,000 to 3,000 pesos na siya. Thank you Sir Ramon and this completes my Starbucks Philippines Icon Mugs Yehey Next naman natin ay this one. This is a Mini Barista Christmas Edition from Malaysia So this is from Malaysia from Ate Joyce and syempre kasama pa niyan ay ang ah, ito na laglag saan na siya ang keychain Starbucks leaf card na may keychain na leaf din also from Malaysia thank you Ate Joyce next natin naman ay this bag oh, this is a gift from Girly, a super friend, birthday gift. Ah, hindi ko siya na-open. Thank you, Girly. Ah, ano ba? Ah, a Bim Bear series na mom. So, tingnan natin kung anong Bim Bear siya. So, Bim Bear series in orange box. And, oh, Universal Studios Hollywood. So, this is a Bim Bear series of Universal Studios Hollywood. Thank you, Gurley! Love it! From Gurley. Thank you, Gurley. 
next from this bag. Ah, okay. This is a loot from also from Sir Manny uh, Mercado through sex, Sir Alex uh, Mercado. Siyang nag padala uh, dito sa akin. These are the ombre or the ah no the rainbow series ng reusable straws. Tatlong era. So, no, meron na rin ako pinakita nito last month. Uh, na regalo din sa akin na isa. So, ito tatlo pang piraso. And, syempre, Starbucks playing cards. Hindi pwede mawala. <laughs> so, this is sold at 6.95 US dollars. And, syempre, hindi ko naman ito gagamitin for display purposes. Ito yung ombre na straw set. So, in one set, tatlo siyang ombre na Venti straws. So this is being sold for 4.95 US dollars or 7.95 Canadian dollars. Thank you, Sir Manny. Next naman ay oh, 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 oh. the insulated lock lunch bag from the US. So this was released in the US. Black plastic ang kanya, parang sako yung kanyang texture and inside, insulated siya yan so maganda siyang gamitin pang baon thank you sir Rani. next naman ay ito this one this is the Statue of Liberty Barista. So, this is released in New York City, 2004. So, I got this for a low price of 500 pesos through Sir Manny Mercado. Okay, ang cute. Talagay ko na siya ulit sa canister. Okay, naman. Dito kang muna, Liberty. natin from this bag. Siyempre, in celebration of the Pride, the Pride Alliance Starbucks pin. So, this is a collaboration of the Pride Alliance group and Starbucks. So, Starbucks has been super supportive with the LGBT community by uh, releasing the rainbow inspired uh, merchandise or the pins like this. They have uh, tumblers then in China and in the US and in Canada, Europe is also Starbucks Europe is also um, celebrating Pride. So they have released in different kinds of pins, merchandise, uh, in support with the LGBT community by placing their rainbow. Uh, I really hope na dito din sa Pilipinas maglabas sila ng rainbow inspired or LGBT or Pride inspired merchandise dito sa Starbucks. Pinipinas. So, yeah. Thank you, Sir Manny. Next naman natin ay uh, this reusable cups that I have bought from Ma'am Jen Joy who is a collector again. So, this is a reusable cup released in Taiwan. I have this kind of grande reusable cups na released din dito sa Philippines na nilabas last May. Pero, ang kinaibahan kasi nila, meron siyang nakasulat na uh, for cold beverage use only in Chinese characters. So, tatlo yung binali kong ganyan kasi I'm collecting three. Dapat pala yung collecting F, uh, every four. Meron din pang isa pang kung binali ganito kay Mang Jen Joy na hot reusable cups naman. Stop ko na siya dito. Ito. Yan. So, meron din siyang uh, Chinese characters na nakalagay reusable, recyclable, and re-enjoyable. So, ito ay 4 pieces. Ito, three pieces. Also from Mount Chen Joy. Next, naman natin ay ito, coffee passports. Coffee passport 
and a complimentary upsize coupon from Starbucks Reserve. So this I ah uh, binigay nila no nagkaroon ng coffee uh, journey na tour sa podium yehi sa podium last uh, parang third week of uh, June ang mga bako June 22 tama June 22 nagkaroon ng event si Starbucks Reserve in podium na nagpakita ng different methods ng kanilang pagbubulo ng coffee. So, nilaunch din nila doon ang different nilang mga drinks. So, eto naman ay binigay nila para maging mag-serve as note, notebook ng mga matututunan mo doon sa kanilang pagbubulo ng uh, coffee and different methods. And pati yung mga beans na ginagamit nila for different kinds of Starbucks Reserve drinks. So, si Starbucks Reserve, sabi ko nga dati, sila ay naglalabas ng mga uh, doon lang sa kanilang menu ay may mga finest beans may mga different kinds of beans na or coffees on their menu na wala sa regular Starbucks stores so if you're trying to find different kinds of coffee or different ways of brewing coffee go to different Starbucks reserve branches so ito yung Starbucks reserve na coffee passport. So, ito din naman yung kanilang mga paper cups ng Starbucks Reserve. Humingi lang ako ng tatlong peraso doon sa, ano, sa event para meron ako mag-stop dito. Pero sa mga regular Starbucks na stores, color white lang yung ganito nila. Next natin ay from this ay, sorry. Apart from this coffee passport, nagbibigay din sila ng Starbucks na pen. Retractable pen. However, kasi dun sa event na yun, nagpamigay din sila ng Starbucks Reserve passport holder na leather. Pero, sadly and unfortunately, hindi kami nakakuha. Kasi, first 1,000 customers or first 1,000 visitors lang sa kanilang event per day nagbibigay sila ng gano'n. Yung pagdating namin, naubusan na kami. So, instead of uh, the passport holder, they gave us a free complimentary size ng kanilang drink na coupon. Pero hindi ko na siya nagamit. So, i-stay ko na lang siya dito as a collection. Yeah. Next natin, from this book. Ito naman ay mga Starbucks magnets of different sizes. So, yung kanilang mga Starbucks magnets na drinks, Mac Caramel, Mocha, Vanilla, Starbucks card na red magnet, plus the different coffees. So, they have this uh, 2015 anniversary blend na magnet. Ito, Katikati blend, Starbucks, released in 2016, and the three vision blend na, na magnet released in 2016 also. So, uh, I bought this from Mam Jenki through the help of my cousin at the choice. Okay. Next naman ay this pumpkin reusable cup. This is a release from Argentina. So I got this for a low price of uh, 300 pesos. Tapos inside the inside this reusable cup ay mga cards. Siyempre, di ba nga nagkakolekta ko ng double, so meron nung kanilang beverage, cold, cold beverage na mini, Starbucks Philippines card, the Swirl Starbucks mini card, the Black Siren into the wood wooden card, also from Starbucks Philippines, the Seahawks from the Starbucks US, tapos ang kanilang Sunset card from Starbucks Philippines. Also, three scale cards from Starbucks Philippines. Also. I got this also from Mang Jeng. So, ito ka muna. Para hindi kayo mawala. Before ko kayo ilagay sa inyong mga albums. Next from this book ay this one. This is a short reusable cup 
holiday edition from Japan. So, itong uh, reusable cup na to na binili ko ng kay Mang Jenki and this is uh, released this was released in Japan last 2018. Actually, this came with the drip uh, coffee na parang hindi ko kasi siya mabasa naka Japanese ano siya characters pero ganyan siya so, ganito din yung itsura niya na originally meron siyang kasamang isang sachet ng coffee na gagamitin mo dapat yung personal drip coffee uh, drip na kasama nito actually wala na siya kasi syempre nagamit na yun dahil baka magigit sa parasite so I'm just after the reusable card. Another card ay the Seahawks card. So, gusto ko lang siya kasi dahil sa million na green na card. So, also, I got this from uh, Mam Jenki. Another naman ay the You Are Here Quezon City. Actually, I have this na. Complete ko na yung uh, You Are Here series ng uh, Philippines. But, kasi a friend a collector friend from Mexico wants this. So, nagpasabay siya sa akin ng bili. So, Mang Jenki, thank you. So, ano pa ba? And last, but not the least, this Starbucks Singapore exclusive tumbler. So, this is a Starbucks Singapore exclusive tumbler na nilabas lang nila sa recently opened Starbucks Jewel in Changi Airport. So, doon lang siya pwedeng mabili. At ang mag dito, this is a lead activated. So, ilalim niya, may ilaw. May ilaw siya. So, maganda siya kapag sa gabi. So, umiilaw siya ng ganyan. Battery operated. Tapos, uh, LED light. So, sa loob, makikita mo na. So, this is a Singapore exclusive and I'm lucky enough to, to get a piece of this. Siyempre, hindi ko siya gagamitin dahil nakakatakot baka masira yung LED light. So, this is good for display purposes only. Yay! We off na natin sa yung battery. <laughs> so this is sold at 33.90 Singaporean dollars. Thank you Ate Joyce for helping me to get this Starbucks Singapore tumbler. So this is a an exclusive tumbler from Starbucks Changi Airport. Star or the Starbucks Jewel store in Changi Airport. So, wala Unfortunately, wala no? from this bag. So, another uh, mga coupons from the Starbucks coffee journey. Last natin, syempre, different cards. Yeah. So, ito yung card na Happy Father's Day na release in time for the celebration of Father's Day in the Philippines. For an initial reload of 500 pesos, you can get this card with a beautiful envelope. Next, this from the Philippines. Next naman ay these cards from Chi, our pharmacist. So, New York bullet. Tapos, ito naman yung cardboard type ng kanilang card in the US. Siren Special Edition from the US. Also, thank you cardboard cards from the US. And another set of New York cards from Chi. Thank you, Chi. Tapos, Siyempre, from Starbucks, Australia. From Joker. So, the wood, wood card, Starbucks, Australia card. Tapos, yung kanilang hot 
coffee na card. Another card naman na yung nagong design. The Sakura card. Next. Ay, ito hindi naglabas ng ganito sa Philippines. Yung ganitong picture. I don't know kung anong pangalan niya. Pero, ang ganito yung print. Next naman natin, the card ay parang holiday edition card parang somehow desert desert ang kanilang itsura mukhang ito yung disierto disierto doon sa Australia tapos syempre the silver silent card Australia na and the thank you card thank you card na ang hirap makakuha sa Pilipinas kasi kailangan mong bumili ng aircon para makakuha ng ganitong thank you card. So, meron naman ako doon. Hindi ako bumili ng aircon pero nagkaroon ako ng thank you card na ganito. Ito naman ay ang Australian version. Next natin ay the Valentine's card. Australian version. So, ito naglabas ng ganito din sa Philippines dati. Yan, yung card para din initial reload the 500 pero ito nakuha ko lang dahil kay Jupiter through this recent travel in Australia so 2 4 6 8 cards from Australia siguro ginamit niya to, to purchase the Bernistas kangaroo and koala yeah thank you jokes and last but not the least syempre from Mam Jenki happy valentines card So, ito ay for free niyang ibigay sa akin. So, there you have it. Wala na. Kaya natin na lahat na uh, packaging and stock. Ang dami yan. Yay. Wala na. <laughs> so, that's it for my vlog 2000. Ah, vlog number 13. My Starbucks haul for the month of June. So, For your, uh, for your questions or your suggestions, kung anong gusto niyo yung feature ko on my next vlogs, just comment down below. Send me a direct message or a private message, and um, follow me on Instagram at Crazy for Someone, on Twitter at Tanjan Arin, on Facebook I have my Facebook page na pinatakita ko lahat ng mga updates from Starbucks or anything about Starbucks. Just search uh, Jan Patrick Tan and you can add me up on my Facebook, Jan Patrick Tan. Follow, like, and subscribe. Turn the, not uh, the notifications on or the bell button for my YouTube channel. Just search for Jan Patrick Tan and follow me, subscribe. And, ayun lang. So, happy watching. Thank you. And happy collecting! Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed my videos. Bye bye. Good night.